So spring is right around the corner, and that means it's out with the old and in with the new. Well, somewhat new. Thrifting is a great way to change up your wardrobe on a budget. So today, we're going thrift shopping, and I'm going to be sharing my top 10 tips to help make the search for vintage clothes a little easier. Tip number one. The smaller the town, the better the thrifting. You might assume the nicer neighborhoods have better thrifting, but it's the exact opposite. Smaller towns have stuff shipped in from all over. Vintage finds will go faster in bigger cities, but not here. Tip number two, don't limit yourself to thrift stores. Pre-thrifted shops and antique stores are also great locations to find vintage clothes. The local antique shops in my area are huge warehouses with spaces rented out by people looking to get rid of clutter from their closets or their grandmother's kitchenware. Tip number three, befriend the staff. If you plan on visiting a particular store in the future, befriending the staff could lead to some great finds. They might even point you in the right direction of what you're looking for or set items aside for you. Tip number four, wear the right outfit. Most thrift stores don't have dressing rooms where you can try on items, so it's best to wear something like leggings or a simple shirt in order to try on clothes over it. Tip number five, if you found a great thrifting location, make sure to ask what days they restock. Thrifting closer to the restock days could secure you some great finds. Tip number six, power in numbers. Thrift stores are huge, which means it could literally take forever to search through everything. Bring a friend along and then divide and conquer. You can each be on the lookout for certain items. Tip number seven, be aware of prices. You would think that thrift stores had the lowest prices, but many locations have caught on to the vintage trends, especially pre-thrifted shops, and they will charge more for certain items. So make sure to check prices online to ensure you're getting the best deal. Tip number eight. Don't get tunnel vision. Just like going to the mall or the store, if you're in search for just one specific item, you could leave disappointed. Keep an open mind and look for potential. Tip number nine, bring cash. Most thrift stores will charge a service fee for using a credit or debit card. So save yourself a few bucks and bring cash. Other locations may only take cash, so it'll be your only option. But what happens if you leave empty handed? Tip number 10, try thrifting apps. Apps like Poshmark are easy to use and are designed to help you buy and sell clothing items. The best part of it is that you're able to make offers on certain items to get it in your price range. I hope you guys enjoyed this 10 tips video and happy thrifting.